New tonight, Orange County deputies say they've arrested the man who shot and killed a mother and her 20-year-old daughter in front of two young children. The sheriff's office posted this video after taking Radrick Francois into custody. And just hours ago, he faced the judge. This arrest comes after the women were found yesterday inside a car near the Lake Sherwood apartments off of Popka Vineland Road. News 6's Treasure Roberts is live at the Orange County Sheriff's Office tonight. And Treasure deputies say this suspect had close ties to the victims. Yes, Eric, really close. Deputies say he shot the mother of his child and her mom right in front of two children. Appoint the public defender's office to represent you and you're going to be held on no bond. 20 year old Radrick Francois is facing two counts of first degree murder, accused of shooting two women to death and is now at the Orange County Jail on no bond. The Orange County Sheriff's Office says shots were fired Friday around 1130 in the morning on London Crest Drive at the Lake Sherwood Apartments. OCSO identified the two victims as 20 year old Tanga Owens and her mother, 39 year old Tanisha Starr. According to the arrest affidavit, surveillance cameras captured video that morning of both women arriving at the apartment complex. Investigators say Francois was talking to them outside of the car before firing inside the vehicle. Then the suspect grabbed he and Owen's two year old daughter before running through the complex. Owen's eight month old son was left behind in a car seat. Seconds later, investigators say Owen's mother got out of the driver's seat and stumbled onto the ground. Deputies were already at the complex for a different investigation, so they blocked off all exits. The report says Francois's mom told investigators there was an ongoing custody battle between Francois and the mother of his child and that he intended to kill her. The suspect ran to his first floor apartment at the complex where investigators spotted him from outside. Eventually, deputies got him and he confessed to shooting Owens, but claimed it was in self-defense and that he did not mean to shoot her mother. Nearby residents tell News 6 the violence is unsettling. There's so many angry people in it, and the innocent people are paying the consequences, which is not supposed to be. That's not the way of life. Both of the women involved were rushed to the hospital where they later died, but the two children at the scene were not injured. At the Orange County Sheriff's Office, Treasure Roberts getting results, News 6.